Hello everybody and welcome back to my channel and for today's video we're gonna do another DIY video but this time it's not home decor DIYs because the thing is that I've shown you most of them already so today it's just gonna be normal random DIYs but I have some really really fun ones and I'm so excited the weather is crazy there's some kind of storm going on and everything so I hope it won't bother you too much anyways let's just get started we're gonna start with one that I've seen so long ago but I can finally share it with you it's a DIY body scrub I I think you may have seen this already, but I think this is so cool and I so want to make this myself. Sugar, body gel, and coconut oil. I just think this is so fun. I think I have all of this at home already, so it's really easy to make. It's free, which is really nice. My scrubs go so fast during the summer. I use them a lot. I'm so gonna make this. I'm so excited for that. Then another one, which is actually very popular. I know, but I just wanted to include it. It's clay rings. I think they're pretty cool. I don't know if I would wear them, because they're very chunky and that's not really my kind of style. I do think they're really cool. Playing around with clay is just really fun. You can make whatever you want, so that's really nice. The next one is so completely random. I always did this when I was a kid. You have these beads. I don't know the exact name for them. Basically, you make some kind of shape with the colors that you have and then you iron it and it becomes like one piece. It's really cute. But this was so fun to do when I was a kid. Like you can make whatever you want. You can make big things, small things. You can decorate your room with it you can use it for whatever you want and it's adorable then this isn't really a DIY it's some kind of nail design I just thought this was so incredibly cool and I love nail polish it looks so simple like you make two dots you connect the dots and it seems so easy and I so want to try this but I don't think it's gonna go well I just really love this idea then this next one making a necklace but this one in particular is a cherry necklace oh my god I love this so much I really want to do this myself I also love how small the beads are that she uses like I am obsessed I love those beads necklaces they're so aesthetic and they're adorable and just great for summer so I kind of want to do this myself. Let me know if you want a video as well in which I make these kind of DIYs because I also really love this. Okay, this one's probably the most random one and I don't know what this is good for. It just looks really good. So I wanted to include it. Basically, she makes balls of ice with flowers in them. I don't know if I would actually put them in my drink because when they melt, you have flowers in your drink but I just thought they looked cool. <laughs> That's basically all. So I, uh, yeah, I'm sorry. <laughs> this one's a little bit more complicated, but also just looks really great, actually. She makes this frame with stuff on top of it. I don't know. The main part is this, like she has like paper with color in them and then she like mixes it or something. And then she puts flowers in it and she basically just makes aesthetic paper. I just thought that this looked so cool. I don't know how easy this actually is. I think it looks really great. Maybe you could use that as room decor. Maybe you could put it in a picture frame as well and use that as room decor. You can go so many ways with this. And I just thought it was actually very original. We have another scrap. I just thought I'd include two because this one uses different ingredients and stuff. So I thought it'd be fun to try different ones. This one uses honey as well. I really like that. And I believe honey is really good for your skin as well. She uses sugar, lime juice, honey, olive oil, and body wash. I really want this. I just really want to make this. I love butt scrubs. Oh my god, I think this one is so incredibly fun. I don't think I could do this personally. But if you know how to do something like this, then oh my god, make it. I just love what she's making. I don't know how to do this. But it looks really cool. And it's a mini frog. And I just love it. You can make so many different designs with this but i just i want to be this creative i really want to be this creative but i'm not and i hate that <laughs> it's just incredibly cool it also looks so fun to do but i just have no idea how you do it <laughs> this one's also kind of more room decor i just like this idea like he just got some tray that is like not even painted and then they paint it they print out pictures you could also just buy one of those collage thingies that i have on my wall basically they just put the pictures on the bottom of the tray and i think this is so smart i don't think of these kind of things i just thought this was really really smart to do like especially with these kind of trays they're just also plain and basic and like you have some cute ones but not like this not at all you can do this in so many different ways and i really liked it i have another nail design design right here i also thought that this is so smart i feel like you have to have some control over the 
brush. I don't, <laughs> I'm not really good at this kind of stuff, but I just really love this look and I still want to try it sometime and I still want to do it well. I don't know if I could, but I just love this. Like it seems so incredibly easy, but I think she's just good at it, you know? This next one, I also love. She makes them as like keychains, but I just love how they look. I again have no idea how you do something like this, but if you can, here's an idea. Like, I think this is so cool. You could also make this like friendship keychain or something. Like you make one for you and your friend and they're like matching and it's really cool. And I wish I could do this. If someone could make this for me, I would love you. This next one is also really smart and I kind of want to try this sometime. She paints her own like canvas back. Is that, that's how you call it, right? Toe back. I really love this idea. I think it's so smart. You don't have to do something complicated like this like you can make something so much easier but i really like this i kind of want to try this sometime i'm just scared like if you wash it or something will it ruin the bag like what if it gets dirty and you have to wash it like i'm really curious because i do kind of want to try this sometime this one again a little bit more complicated but cool you could also do this in many different ways but if you're a little bit more creative this may be a good idea for you to try if you're bored maybe that's why you're watching this video i don't know i just think this is really smart and cool the way that she does this Again, I would never come up with something like this. <laughs> I so would not. You can do this in so many ways. You can be so creative with this. Decorating your own faux cases is so much fun. I really like stuff like this. I also really like how it turned out. Like, she did a really good job. The next one, also kind of random, also kind of home decor-ish. I don't know exactly what she uses, but this is kind of like a beach look. I just thought it looked really cool. I love the look of this, and especially for summer, this is so cool. And again, this is like pretty easy, and you can easily like sell or something like that'd be really fun let's see if she has something else like this i'm confused what are those things she's using like it looks really cool and satisfying i have no idea what those things are but they look kind of cool this one is so incredibly random but so cool and i don't know <laughs> if you ever have some kind of invitation or something on paper this is so cool i don't know how people come up with this kind of stuff but i just loved this so much it looks so good it's so aesthetic this is our 18 birthday invitation and I love that she's actually doing this on paper because nowadays the invitations that I get are just through text and that's like so kind of impersonal and so today's generation but it's actually so not fun <laughs> I just love the way that she's doing this especially with like that on top of it like how do you call it like a seal isn't that how you call that this is just so incredibly original so please if you're gonna like give a party or something for your birthday or whatever do something like this it's so incredibly cool this is another video of the paper this one's a little bit different she doesn't use the picture frame it kind of comes out the same way it's just another way to do this again i just love the look of this and you can go so many different ways with this you can use it for so many different things and i just think it looks really cool so i just thought i'd give you another video of this this one is a little bit more hardcore you have to be good with like sewing sewing you have to be good with clothes she makes her own cute top and i want to be able to do this i so want to be able to do this if you follow me for a long time you know that i love clothes i just love the look of this the way that it turns out her idea and everything i also love the top i like the print of it on the flowers they're so cute i just love this you just need a lot of practice for this kind of stuff i have nine so but this is so cool. So if you're good with something like this, this is a great idea. And this is just a random video with also home decor ideas, but just some cute ideas, which some of them I've mentioned already. I don't know what the first one is exactly, but I also like the idea with painting your charger. I also really love the light bulb thing with the flowers on it. I think it looks so cool. And the stones as well. I've never showed that before, but you can also use that for so many things. It's also just some kind of fun summer activity. Like if you're bored with your friends, just just collect some stones and go paint them like that is so random but so fun to do so that were the diys that i had for you definitely let me know if you'd like me to try some of these there's some that i really want to try out so i might just do it anyway but okay i hope you like this video as well it wasn't really home decor specifically but i thought they were still a lot of fun if you liked it don't forget to give it a thumbs up and subscribe to become a part of the family i will link all the links down below of the tiktok that I showed you in this video and I hope I'll see you next week.